Hi, my name is Tara. I'm Dave. We're the We're Thirsty, Thirsty Thrifters. Thrifters. Cheers. Cheers. We normally make videos mostly about selling clothing on Poshmark. My Poshmark closet name is Tara Stutes, all one word. If you want to go check it out. That's not what this video is about. We have a haul of some weird stuff and a story to go behind it about how we obtained all these items. Do you want to start the story? No, you can go. You're, you're the storyteller. <laughs> Dave doesn't know. I don't know what she's doing. We were contacted by a friend, acquaintance of ours, who's an estate attorney and needed some help. He That's had, how the story yeah, starts. You remember this story? Yeah. <laughs> he had this house that needed cleaned out. The items sold, money made, put into the estate, the house cleaned, all that kind of stuff, and he thought of us. So that's what we've been doing for nearly two full weeks. Thanks, Bash. Dave did the garage clear out first. We needed some immediate money to pay some bills. So you want to tell about your garage clear out? So the coolest thing in the garage is still not sold. It's a 1956 Pontiac Chieftain, which is a gorgeous car super old it runs but uh no title so we're working on that but there was um a brand new you don't have to list everything there was a lot of lawn equipment cub cadet and zero turn it. lawnmower lots of stuff lots and lots of equipment hand tools so dave learned let go for that he downloaded let go which we didn't use before yeah i i'd say let go is uh Better for me, I don't know what everybody else thinks, but I think let goes better for me than uh, Facebook Marketplace. We've put stuff on there before and usually it just seems like more of a hassle than anything with the way people are constantly just asking you whether it's sold or not and then they don't follow up. It's just a big cluster. But let go, it seemed like everybody that um, messaged me was actually interested in buying whatever it was I was trying to sell. So there's a tip for you selling locally. So the next step was we had to clean the house. We got a huge dumpster. There was a lot of trash. We had to sort through and figure out what was can be sold in a sale and what would go in the dumpster. Then we had to tag everything like a garage sale. We were going to call it an estate sale and we're advised to call it more of a yeah, yard rummage sale because we're not licensed we're to not be estate. We're not licensed estate folks people so <laughs> we so, had a big giant room to sell we had a big sale for two days and then we had a lot of things that didn't sell and we were told that stuff whatever Still we want to do with it so a huge amount will be picked up in a couple days from a local thrift store charity and they're gonna take it all but there were some things that were interesting that we're gonna try to sell on eBay I'm not a fan of eBay. Dave doesn't sell on eBay much. He's helped me some. But these things have to go on eBay. They're not clothing. So this is a weird variety. We're gonna show you the things we're gonna to try to sell. If you know some details about these things, please comment because a lot of this stuff is outside our expertise. We're gonna be learning as we go, but that's how you find things that are worth money in the next sale is you bought it once and looked it up and figured out if it sold and to keep us going through this video we forgot to mention oh, yeah. our habit of having wine while we do the hauls this one's a weird one it's called Cripsis. <laughs> i don't know what that means but it's a uh it's a red blend it's a so red blend from the north coast of california so this is from our bright sellers subscription oh, okay. box and we really like Pretty much everything they send us is good. Yeah, we can this link is good. them below. It's a good dry it, yeah. uh, red. So we're gonna just go through these things uh, carefully because we can't toss clothing behind the, cam the camera like we usually do. <laughs> so you wanna start yeah. with something? There's a, there's a tag in between those. These so, are two things. Check out these. <laughs> What are they? Are they like, uh, cam is that a camel? The camels? No, it's got weird horns. Almost like a... Goats or something? You see what I mean? 
Yeah. So it had a tag. I think this tag goes with it. Yeah. And it's from oh, the Blackfoot Indian Blackfoot tribe. Blackfoot Indian artifacts. So these people had a large curio cabinet and a lot of real Native American artifacts that somebody came and got. Like the first person there bought almost all of them. There were a few things left, so we're going to see if they're worth anything. That has a price on the tag, right? Like not our price. But the price from the $195 yeah from the place that they bought it and that looks like so there's stone there's writing circa, on the bottom circa 1890 I can't read the writing on the bottom so we don't know if these are real they're very heavy that's gonna be fun to ship wow pretty neat so that's, okay. that's item one so this one I did look these up on eBay and I think they were selling for like $20. I had it priced at 10 at the sale. So it's in clay stone. And it's like this rose color. And I don't know what kind of flowers these are. I don't know anything about flowers. So it's just like a jewelry box or storage Probably. box. But it seems very nice. So that I'm going to look that up. Oh, yeah, I got to look this up. It may be worthless, but I'm it's gonna interesting. Go, I'm going to go with worthless. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. <clears throat> I would have thrown this in the dumpster. It's Kodak. It's an old camera. Camera. But it, look, it, it's in there. Even as a display piece, I think that'd be kind of cool. And it has, what's this little tag? Connersville. Okay, it's got a ticket from maybe a basketball game. I think there's some film in here. No, really? Yeah. We ha yeah, there is. Coda Color X exposed. Oh, it's they've already taken they've the already pictures. Done. Wow. And I don't want to know. We what's had so on. much stuff to go through quickly, so we didn't look up everything. Okay, let's stick with the cameras, and I'll grab this camera. This is a more modern camera. And I did look this up online, but you know we'll give it a shot to sell. It's a Coolpix L840 and it's dirty. Everything in the house was dirty. We had a lot of dusting that we did. <laughs> there's dust all over it. Yeah. But I'm still there's having that. nightmares of how dirty. We only have to go back there one more time. There's that camera. Um, I don't even know what else is in the box besides the instruction manual. But I'll try selling that online. What do you want to do next? Okay, this is one piece of the set. Yeah. We didn't want to get the whole set out because it's gigantic. It's uh Hulk. Hulk four piece sound bar with subwoofer and two other speakers, surround yeah. sound. And it's got voice activation. It's fancy sound bar. Yeah, it's fancy. This thing's fancy. I did look this up on eBay before I brought it home, and people were selling them for between 150 and 200 with free shipping. So Make a but little we bit. probably will try let go and Craigslist first to avoid the shipping because that's going to be a gigantic box. Okay, let's show, let's show these figurines. I don't know what they are either. Mm. So this was in that same cabinet with all the Native oh. American stuff. Did I just say cabinet? Cabinet. They were in the cabinet, cabinet with all the Native American stuff. <laughs> Um, so they had one little sticker on them. My mom helped me price some stuff. They this have is a wood. Tiny little sticker. This is four hundred and fifty dollars for the pair. These are. These old. are very old. They're carvings. See, this has another sticker that's I'm worn off. I'm scared to touch these. Um, wow. But I don't. I don't have a clue what they are. So if you recognize this. Oh, kind of thing. Asian, it looks like. It looks like um, monks. Yeah, I don't know. I can't, I little, can't read it. Little monks. So that's why it's kind of iffy. We're not really sure how much that is worth or what it is, what you call it. But if it was $450 originally, it might be worth it to, to look it up. Meet Tommy. Um, the robot. This is Tommy. Omnibot. Got the instruction manual, the remote. 
plays cassettes. It plays music. Every we day. don't know how, if it functions, but we. I'm gonna try it out. Think sure. it's kind of nifty. My older brother might purchase this. Take he was, start. He was thinking about it, and I mean, he, so he might. This thing's pretty cool. What are you holding these? Is this open? Yeah, like you can. That one you can opens, take but somebody, this one doesn't. Yeah, you can put a drink in there and drive it to somebody. That's a tiny drink. This one will take care of it if it's bigger. Yeah. <laughs> and I think it. Yeah, it rotates. I'm gonna break it. I'm gonna stop it. Please, yeah, please don't break it. We had it for a hundred dollars oh, yeah. in the sale. We seen them on eBay, not selling for a hundred dollars. I guess. I mean. I think that was a quick look up by Put a one of our in kids. There, put fit. a hot dog in the other hand and you drive it to your buddy <laughs> on the other side of the pool. You that's, do that. You do that. That's what you do with Tommy. Okay, I'll show my big tub of vintage wrapping paper. I just think this is really neat. There's the probably the ones I'm gonna sell on eBay are the ones that are sealed. There's a ton of them that are sealed. Birds, houses, bicycles. Well, like bikes. Like they're all old. They have um, tags from Osco. Well, like if birds. You have, if you ever had an Osco. Birds and bikes. Uh, what was that one? All animals. kinds of animals. There's one in here that's very controversial, I would say, what? because it's Confederacy or something. Oh, let's not show that. There's owls. That is controversial. Owls are very controversial. I know. Just kidding. I love owls. This one's kind of cool. Look, reminds me of 60s or 70s. Oh, wow. What, those are umbrellas. And then there's a bunch that are not sealed. And I may actually, like, take the papers that aren't full or aren't Dragonflies. in package and make them into small thank you notes for my Poshmark packages and things. So I claimed those when they didn't sell. Probably, like, I saw some... People Terrible sell woman. like five or six packages for fifteen dollars, so I probably got thirty. So Edison wanted like an Xbox One. I Tara just want wanted paper. Paper. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, what are these called? I forget. Viewfinder. View, Viewmaster. Viewmaster. Wait, is yeah, it both? Yeah. I think Viewfinder too, or something. So I had these priced. No, Viewmaster. At twenty dollars, and I didn't oh, even look them up. An on owl. eBay. It's an owl. Okay. I didn't look them up on eBay, but I remember they're not cheap on eBay. Can you guys see in there? No. Nope. Oh, good, good job, Dave. Somebody picked it up and said, does that say $20? That's a bird. Like, yeah, this like, is 3D. Um, we've got, and then we have the, what do you call these things? This, this is, is look and see. This is Mickey's trailer. So that's like Disney. Barn swallow. This is, this is wild be, birds of North America. This is birds too. Times two. Wild birds There's of North America. There's three wild birds of North America. <clears throat> what else is in here? Oh, this is more. Bambi. Oh. Wow. That was, um, that so we have the, the things and the two of the Viewmasters, and they're they're uh, legit old. They're not repros or anything. Okay, let's see what this is. I took the sticker off the top, and I got to get it off that tree. So this, I think, is stone. Like jade, maybe? They had a lot of jade things. What is jade? They made this out of stone? And this is metal base. And Do what? it has no markings, no maker markings or anything. It's kind of cracked. So I don't know. You see the cracks? Oh, is it? it may is. not be worth selling. The thing is, if any of these don't sell, we just re-donate them somewhere. No, no big deal. Because they were free to us. We did not pay anything. Wow. But it, what's the scene on the front? There's a. It's tripped up because it's that. stone. It's like a house and it looks very oriental. A guy oh. playing a flute. <laughs> don't you? Yeah, I don't. I don't know why. That's... I don't remember taking this to try to sell online. But yeah, maybe we did. Xbox Connect. Xbox but... Connect. What is that? I don't think it's. So, this person had so many gaming systems, so many laptops, speakers, two 70-inch TVs. There's a bunch of computer tabs. You're going to see like, more coming. 
most of the computer stuff was worthless because it was so old and outdated. Yeah. But he, he oh, liked terrible. gaming. Yeah. I, if this is not broken by now, I'm going to break it. You just broke it. I did not. Well, her arm is this, missing. It's behind her back. Oh, it is missing. Oh, it's on. It's in the bottom of the bag. Yeah. I so, told you you broke it. Oh, look. That's been repaired. Look she at that. Broke it. There's glue on it. Tara broke it. I re-broke it. It's Tara, better. Tara broke the radio. There it had an antique radio. <laughs> huge. <laughs> the huge, huge floor, floor model, model from radios. Like the yeah. 40s. And she went to plug it in and it shocked her and blew the cord off the plug. It separated. Through a breaker. It sparked. Lights went out. My hand was black. <laughs> that was fun. I don't know what these are. It, I, there's all kinds of random numbers on the bottom. Can you see this? All kinds. Worthless now that you broke the arm off the lady. Um, but this is a very fancy man. What'd she do to you? And a matching broke fancy off. woman. Over here. She had a backpack or something. Yeah, that's what she had, I'm sure. A backpack. Oh, it's her hair. Yeah, uh, so these Looks might like not backpack. be worth anything, but if you know anything about these statues, let us know. People aren't into statues right now. Some, maybe They're some tearing them is. down everywhere. In oh, this those, uh, that's what you mean. I don't care. Political what reference, do. I didn't get it. I'm not into statues, so who cares. Uh, headset. TB wireless headset for Xbox, I think. I, I don't know. There were a lot of headsets lots, and lots of gaming. A mouse. And... Who knows? Okay, this is the freakiest thing to me. The freakiest this thing? This is a deer antler. Oh. With a face on it. I don't think that's a deer antler. Caribou antler, I'm yeah. sorry. Caribou. Come on, let's get our uh It says on the back, caribou antler, comma, whale bone. So that must be what some of this is. So somebody comma. just is like I got all these extra body parts. Comma, trade beads, comma, and caribou hide strap. And it's signed by D. Main, M A Y N E, from 1992. And it had a $200 price on it. And we marked it as $35 when nobody bought it. Yeah. So here's it's that. Price literally tag. made of body parts. There's the weird face. Nothing to be creeped face out a face. by. But it's made of body parts. So, uh, and it's a face that's really kind of creepy. We'll look that up on eBay. Don't is it a face inside a face? Is there a ban on selling this stuff on eBay? Yeah, it's a face inside a face. Yes, that's I said that. Creepy. It's your turn. Ooh, these are cool. I, I may have to buy these. The one guy got them out and said they don't adjust. Now, it could just be... We need to fix, we need to they adjust. mess with some. You adjusted them? These are some nice Nikon binoculars. That word was not coming to me right there. There we go. With the strap on the case and a strap on the binoculars. Pretty adjustable to they're, me. They're not gonna be able to see if it worked. Not that part. There's a, not that. There's a, there's a knob where you can zoom in and out and it doesn't do anything. That's oh. what I mean. This is interesting, isn't it? Yeah. We'll work on it later. It's it's not something to do in the video. You may be on to something. I may be on to something? No, that guy. Yeah, they don't adjust. Let's do... <laughs> My son wants these very badly. He has like two or three already. What? Oh, there were five in here and there's only two now. So, the, so the... I think he claims um, and did not. Get permission. Edison! He's not here. Where'd he go? To the neighbor's house. So these are things from uh, Burger King Happy Meal or something. So four are missing. Yeah. Oh, $50 for... Oh, yeah, there's four missing. We had six of them. And they're like gold-plated somethings. Pokemon something. Huh. I wonder if they're in his room. And you can sell these for about $10 each on eBay. And we had six. Somebody offered me ten dollars for all six. <laughs> I know, but we gotta take those back for my son. He doesn't get to just keep everything. 
He thinks he does. You're up next. I put that box there so you could do that one and get it out of the way. This is a... It's a whole gaming system Yeah, here. I'm just going to pull up the controller. It's an Xbox 360. It's, it's in a box. But what else does it have with it? You can just tell us. It has the gaming system. That's it. Doesn't have two controllers? Two controllers. Okay. So that wasn't it. Two controllers. That's it. Nobody bought that. We sold... What other gaming systems did we sell? A PlayStation 4. Xbox One. Uh -huh. Oculus Rift Touch. Uh, yeah. I can't remember what else we sold. Did you sell that old gaming system? Yep. Nah. Yep. It was what like was a it color, color something. ColecoVision. Oh, ColecoVision. ColecoVision. Yeah. It was very old. Uh, we sold... There Edison were more. Bought, we sold a, a DS. Bought another X1. Sold a DS. Yeah. We sold a lot. Oh, we got this thing. This is a something or other. <laughs> something or other. It has a thing in it. Good Brothers and Company Wholesale and Retail. Okay, so it's an antique dealer, but... It Good says brothers. HK, so it's Hong Kong. It says HK, Hong Kong. The bad brothers are worth more. Yeah, I know. Touch of, okay, this is a different place. This is in Nashville, Indiana, Touch which is silver. in the same county we like to go to. Let's see what the invoice says. We don't know if all these cards go to the right things, so. Receipt for $400. Yeah, that's, I think that's why I kept it to sell because it had a receipt for $400. So I don't. I don't know. It's not like inlay or anything. It's, I don't know what it is. I will have to do some Googling. We don't have any of these. So let, me we, <laughs> let me know if you know what this is. We buy stuff that's super functional. We buy clothing. That's very functional. Not, not a box that sits in a curio for 11 right. years. All right, what's up? Uh, I think that's all I have. No, there's watches and things behind that box. Remember how I said if you move the box, you can get to the other things. Do you remember that? I'll do all the watches. I'll just get some more wine while he's doing the watches. You're not supposed to take a drink. We all right, sold so the several first watch watches. Is a Timex. Does that one work? Yeah, it's working. Okay, so I have a sixty dollars sticker on it, so that means I looked it up on eBay and it was selling for more than that. Uh, Citizens Eco Drive. These are really cool watches. I have one. And what's the sticker have on that? Uh, 50 bucks. So it sells it, for more than that on eBay, I know. It um, charges its battery uh, with light. It's not working right now. Yeah, it is. It is? Oh, it was. We need to charge it. That's the box for it, right? No, there's another one in the box. Oh, he's got two. He's got drives. two. I didn't give myself enough wine. Do you want some more? Yeah. Oh, wow. This is a Citizen. This isn't an Eco Drive, though. I'm pretty sure it is. Oh, it is. Man, this is a nice one. Yeah, this one works. I did try to match up the box appropriately. It's a nice one. Yeah, that one looks clean. Mm -hmm. and it I, is. Is that the one that had extra links, or was it a different? I think it was the one we sold had extra links. Oh, no, this one did. Extra. It's a really nice watch. So those are the three watches we have left to sell. He had several other nice watches that sold he had three pairs of sunglasses like two oakley's and one ray-bans and those sold he had very skinny wrists oh really that's the so here's one of my favorite things hidden away in a cabinet let's so the box has a little staining on it it's fabric these are all stone instruments and i found these on ebay several uh, like maybe one that sold or two that sold and three or four for sale and some of them for sale are six to seven hundred dollars for the set and then there's stands these are you can set them up and put the instruments on the stands what? now there may be one thing missing out of here because there's one this one little spot that doesn't have anything in it it's like a bow yeah but what is that instrument um I mean, I studied music in college, but I don't know what this instrument is. Can you see that? Is it weird? And it has a bow with it. I don't know. Yeah, these are some unusual things. I can't imagine like spending the money on this in the first place. One guy was looking at it and said, 
These look like reproduction. Like reproduction of what? The, the ones on eBay look exactly the same. Same containers, same colors, they have the same black stands to sit things on. So we'll be putting that on eBay. Back to the theme of electronics. We got some, another headset. This has got a USB connector. I don't know. I don't, it's an Xbox headset. Plantronics. Yeah. It's probably very nice. It's got a hundred and 49.99 GameStop tag on it, so. All right, we have more antiques. We're almost done, I think. So I found these in their kitchen cabinet, tucked away, hadn't been used in a long time, if ever. So these are Lennox Autumn Pattern Dishes. So it's hand-painted, it's textured, you can feel it. The, um, like little fruit or raised, you can tell that was paint. And they're like, when I Googled it, it's painted in 24 karat gold accents. So they had oh, wow. 12 place settings of this. So that is, there's five pieces in each place setting. They have serving platters, one or two. They have that serving bowl. They have the cream and sugar. This, this is one set of the smaller dishes. I don't know what they're called. I don't know anything about fancy china. Not opened. Now, I don't think this is how they sealed them to store them because there's, there's tons of these that are sealed like this and it has paperwork in it from Linux. So I think almost all the plates are brand new in the package. So, one place setting, one five piece place setting they're selling on eBay for $50. I looked up the large serving platter and they're selling between 100 and 150 for that one plate. For this? I didn't look up the bowl. You've got I mean, the large serving platter? Yeah, yeah, we have that. We have the cream and sugar. I saw like the creamer pitcher was sold for $70. I was stuck in the garage the whole sale. So, so this set is worth quite a bit. Uh, I'm not sure how I'm gonna do this. I don't think I'm gonna sell it as one because I can't imagine somebody's like, I want this entire set and I'm gonna shell out $1,000 for it. I think no, we're gonna have to it piece it out and do place settings and do the large dishes separate. It's probably something, it's old enough that people are looking for replacements. So I think that's the way I'm gonna go, although it might be a hassle. Do you have anything else? Nope. So we have three more things that we cannot sell on eBay and we're not sure what to do with them except oh, basically waste them. I've got a good idea. So the top of this man's refrigerator had a like bar on it basically and there's some inexpensive liquor that is in our kitchen that we'll probably just share with friends. But then there were some things that were not inexpensive. So this is the least expensive one. We don't know anything about this stuff. We don't, we just drink wine. So this is Dalwini, Dalwini Highland Single Malt Scotch Whiskey, 15 years old. When you look them up online, this is like a $70 bottle of whiskey. <laughs> I don't know. That'd be a really nice bottle of wine. Yeah. Here, show this one. Ooh. I don't know why I didn't drink them. They're just, they were dusty on top of the fridge. Oh, this is Lynn. Oh, that's upside down. I didn't put it in upside down. Oh, I probably laid it on its side to open it. Sorry. Glenn Levitt something or other. Okay. 21. That's like a 21. Archive 21. Scotch whiskey. Single malt scotch whiskey. I thought we had this out of the box. Maybe I never took it out. So this is about $300. Dang. We can't sell it. It's not legal to sell liquor unless you're a liquor store in the United States. Can't sell it on eBay. And then we have one more. Dang. Guess we'll just have to drink it. I mean. That's fine. We can drink it. It feels like I'd be very wasteful drinking it. I feel like we should drink it. 
They'd probably, right on. they'd probably think it was awful and just want some wine instead. This is, I don't know how to say this. Tomatin? Tomatin? How would you say it? Tomatin? Yeah, something like that. This is Highland Single Malt Scotch 1988. 1988. And these are also about $300. Still in the box, never opened. Crazy. And can't sell it. So they came home. Guess we'll drink it. So that's, I think, all of the weird things that we brought home to research and sell on eBay. Maybe Dave will help me. Oh, I'll help. Um, I just got done selling all the guns. Oh, gosh. We don't want to talk about that. We don't. We're going to get all these down votes now. Oh, I am. Oh. I do not enjoy guns. I but we get rid of them. It was the job of us as the estate liquidators to sell all his belongings. And we sold them. We I, I didn't touch them. Dave. Dave sold them. And they're all gone now. Well, thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. We would love any thoughts, any advice, any knowledge about any of this stuff. Because we're going to be lost for a while. <laughs> or if you want any of this stuff, you can let us know that too. We'll give you a good deal for saving us some research. For the love of God, someone buy Somebody this. Somebody buy that. We would love it. Get this out of my house. <laughs> Anyway, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for more videos, maybe. Maybe. Probably not like this for a while, but we hope to do it again. We'll stick to Poshmark. It's a little easier. Yeah. So, thanks for watching. Good night. And mm. cheers. Cheers.